Hi guys, it's Natalie here with another channel message for you guys. I hope everyone is doing well. Um, today is Thursday. Um, we're going to pick up an energy for you guys. I'm going to do a little bit differently. I'm just going to jump straight into the tarot um, and go backwards with the oracle. Just something different. All right. So let's pick up an energy for you guys. Um, if you needed a more personal reading, go ahead and email me and I will let you know what I can do for you. Which, by the way, I wanted to address something about my personal readings. Most people like to, um, you know, they, they vent and they like to send me paragraphs. I don't really mind the venting. Like, I'll read it, you know, just because, you know, I don't really mind venting. I got, if you want to send me a paragraph, go ahead and send me a paragraph as long as you're respectful and things of that nature. But it doesn't really influence my readings. It's like, um... Whenever you get a personal, whatever comes out is what's supposed to come out. But, you know, I will still listen to you. So I don't know if I, there was a few people out there that wondered if they were like, I don't know. I, I still read everybody's emails, even if I don't respond. And you're not bothering me. It's okay. <laughs> but anyway, um, also, if anyone needed a personal reading, my information is in the description box below for you down there. Um, let's get this started. Let me pick up an energy for you guys, for the collective. I'm gonna do something different. What's the energy for my collective right now? Holy Spirit and angels. We're getting a lot of downloads in my dreams. Um, I just hope it's not going to affect your guys' reading. Okay, so we have this Queen of Pentacles in the reverse right now. What? Picking up Scorpio Capricorn energy. Okay, wow. Queen of Wands in the reverse. Knight of Wands in the reverse. Three of Swords in the reverse. And the Six of Cups in the reverse. What bothers me is this Queen of Wands in the reverse with the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. This is either two different energies or it's one energy that's very jealous and selfish and envious. And it's not a good way to start out a reading, but whatever. This is what Spirit wants me to pick up today. This person is going through like a shock in their life. It's like something about, I'm hearing, what is Stockholm sy Syndrome? Isn't that like when you're attached to your childhood or like you feel like, I, I know it has a lot to do with your childhood or something from the past. It's like memories hold you to certain things that you aren't supposed to be hold, held on to or something like that. It's like you're you're stuck to something even if it's bad memories. Like it's like that. There's good memories and there's bad memories. And some people are stuck to their past based off of bad memories. It's like they don't try to heal themselves of those bad memories. They just want to stay stuck to them. We have the Eight of Wands in the verse, the Queen of Wands in the verse. This person is also jealous or something like that. And it's like things are backfiring onto them. A very envious person. I feel like this person, the reason why I said this could be two different energies um, is because this queen of Wa queen of pentacles in the reverse looks like a different energy. She looks like someone who may have it all, but someone here could be like act like either. I don't. I'm not getting imposter, but I feel like someone feels like this person is an imposter. Who's this queen of pentacles in the reverse? I feel like someone had intentions on making this person look this way. Page of wands in the reverse, the sun in the reverse, and the four of cups out here bad news is being exposed yeah nine of wands in reverse someone here is giving up and choosing a new path so someone here is giving up and choosing a new path it's like they had enough of something someone here is not happy where they're at and it's like bad news is someone else here page of wands in reverse with the sun in reverse has been exposed someone here is not happy about it Someone is also not happy about how immature someone is. Clarify the Knight of... We have the Queen of Swords out here and the Two of Cups in the reverse. Someone here, like... They didn't want so, they didn't want a, a union to come together or a collaboration or two people coming together. The Two of Cups is in the reverse. Based off of what someone here was saying, this uh, partnership was split up. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, there's that Queen of Wands again in the reverse with the Ace of Cups in the reverse with the Ten of Wands. I feel like this person is jealous because, I don't know, maybe they feel like they'll never find love or something like that. I don't know who this is. It could very well be a mother energy. 
but we have this queen of wands in reverse it's like she's very um envious or jealous or I feel like envy or jealousy has slowed a partnership down or something or slowed an offer from coming forward. Now this person is actually very burdened. Why the Ace of Cups in reverse though? That gives me someone that doesn't have self-love. So this person doesn't have self-love. Yeah, the Knight of Cups is out here. Queen of Swords. So I'm also getting like someone here wants to speak to someone that's not speaking to them. They don't want to deal with this Queen of Wands in the reverse. They're actually very burdened that this per this person and maybe a few other people know this person wants to come towards you. I feel like not only do you not care, Collective, because I feel like there's a Queen of Swords out here who has her back turned to all of this. You could actually have two, there's two females here that you don't care about at all. There's two of them. There's a Queen of Wands in reverse with a Queen of Pentacles in the reverse. There's that Knight of Pentacles in the reverse with the Four of Wands in the reverse. Someone here slowed down. Uh, someone here slowed down a, a house coming to you, or a relationship, or a marriage, or something like that. They slowed it down. It's not slowed down anymore. There it is again. So someone here is unstable. Someone here is very unstable. I feel like something here backfired on this person. Now they're unstable. Four of Wands is in the reverse. It's like their relationships or their marriages are messed up, or Four months in reverse is not a, a stable, let's chill and relax and have a celebratory time because we're together type of union card. This person is not in that mindset. In fact, they try to slow it down for you or they wanted you to feel this way. Clarify the Six of Cups in the reverse for the collective. Someone here has bad memories. Yeah, there's a moon card, Page of Pentacles. They have secrets too. Eight, eight of yeah. They have secrets, or they have like things going on with inside them that they can't move on from here. But I'm getting more of a secret. Someone here is holding back a secret, or like they can't let go of something, or someone here has oh, someone's secret is that they never moved on. So someone here is pretending like they haven't moved on. Why is the eight of cups in the reverse? Clarify that someone here doesn't want to move on from someone maybe they're not letting other people know okay maybe you know that this person wants to come towards you but they're not letting other people know because these people have a lot to do with their past and they like to keep them hidden they keep them hidden for a reason i feel like there's a um a deep emotional issue with these people or this person here Okay, I don't have to clarify that. Let me move on because I already got the message. Clarify the, uh, the tower, please. They they hide this, that they can't move on from their past or their childhood or something like that. Clarify the tower. But there's going to there's gonna be a shakeup. It's like something here has to give, something here has to change. Where's the, why is the tower here, please, for the collective? Seven of Pentacles in reverse with the Lovers. Five of Cups in reverse with the Ace of Swords in the reverse with the Chariot. Something here was a bad investment. Seven of, Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. Next to the Lovers. So someone here like invested terribly in a uh, relationship or like something that was connected to a relationship. I'm also getting like, I don't know, I don't know if it was like hard work or not, but someone here was put, like putting hard work or someone here thought that something here would make you mad or like feel regretful. I'm also getting something like someone here was in denial about their love or something like that. No, this person here is receiving bad karma for leaving you out in the cold. That's what it was. That's what they were invested in doing. They're realizing that wasn't working. I don't know if that was this person that you're dealing with or the, the people around them because there's people around this person. There's two feminines out here. Look, seven of swords and the devil as soon as I brought up the feminines. Someone here knows about these people. Virgo, Capricorn, Aquarius energy. So Ace of Swords in reverse, that's okay. So that either that's denial or there was a big lie. Ace of Swords in reverse is a big lie. 
someone here didn't have enough clarity someone here didn't think that you would move on or like choose someone else or something like that clarify the queen of wands in the reverse or they didn't think things will go in your favor some of you thought that they could hide something for a really long time. Clarify the Queen of Wands in reverse. They had help. These, okay, this Queen of Wands in reverse, Queen of Pentacles in reverse could be related. Or like they just know each other because I feel like they're on the same page. Or they're one person. Look, Magician in reverse, Eight of Wands in reverse, Eight of Swords. Whatever this jealous, envious, nasty, promiscuous. I mean, what can we call the Queen of Wands in reverse? She doesn't hold on to her sexual energy. She doesn't have any chill. She's messy. All that's backfiring onto them. They thought that this was magic. They thought that this, it, it wasn't magic. It was more like over manipulation. Trying to silence people around them too. Cause I see a lot of this moon and high priestess energy. I feel like this moon and high priestess, like someone here is vowed to like not speak on them. They, there's a few people out here that don't speak on this person. And they think that's power, but no, that's not power because whoever seen you or whoever was involved or see, look, my throat chakra is closing up. Whoever's involved will be speaking up soon. They just feel attached to you because I don't know, could be childhood issues. This could be a mother. This will be dealt with one way or another. Um, it's, it's being held. It's being held in the ethers with the moon and the high priestess. Someone knows about it. Someone knows what this person has done or offered. It was an offer. And it was a bad offer. There was things going on here. But <clears throat> look, my throat chakras. <sighs> All right, so we have the magician in reverse, eight of wands in reverse, eight of swords in reverse, eight of swords out here. There's someone's a mental jail, a spiritual jail, just someone here feels stuck. This is the Queen of Wands in reverse is also like, I don't know, for some of you, this was like that I can take your man energy. Now they're stuck. Queen of, Queen of Swords in reverse, like, yeah, the hermit. Someone here has been found out. Someone here sees what this person is doing. And then we have the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. It's like someone here is losing a lot of money. Clarify this. Yeah, Page of Swords is out here. Just came out in the Five of Pentacles. Someone here is out in the cold. It's like they're on the outside looking in. Look at that. Queen of Pentacles. So either it's a mother out here. It could be like a Virgo Taurus Capricorn. I'm picking more of a Capricorn energy that's out in the cold. Or, or it could be a Leo. Okay. Um, Someone here is like, someone here is on the outside looking in. Knight of Wands in their verse. I feel like someone here wanted to like split up a marriage or something like that. They were like determined for it. Yeah, I said determined and the and the chariot card came out. They're determined to compete into something that's not com like not is competable a word. Cause it's that's that's what this is. It's like this person couldn't fight you or they couldn't like fight you off here with heartbreak. I feel like this person tried to hurt you or something like that. It didn't work. I feel like someone here like moved on too fast or like you're like a very determined person here collective so it's like this person worries about fighting and you're worried about like you're moving on you're moving on to success or something like that or you're just like a i don't know someone here thought that they could hurt you as you were moving on picking up cancer virgo pisces leo libra with the three of swords out here i feel like you heal from this because the three of swords is right here in the reverse seven of cups in the reverse too But hold on, why is the Three of Swords upright right here? Because someone else is heartbroken out because someone here doesn't want to fight with them. They're just going to move on. Yeah, strength out here. Something about resilience. Nine of Cups in the reverse with the Six of Cups. Someone here is like, um, Two of Wands. Someone here wants to commit and they're realizing their strength is being loyal to like, healing their childhood and doing things like that. I feel like whoever's in this person's life is not into healing their childhood and they don't want this person to be into that either. 
All right? <clears throat> I repeat the three of swords in our verse. Is that devil? This person wants me to shut up. I don't care. Look, it could be a masculine for some of you. The devil out here with the uh, king of pentacles in reverse. This is someone unreliable. Three of wands is out here. I'm also getting like, okay. They wanted you to be hurt by an unreliable person. They wanted you to like, feel like you need this person or something like that. Okay, so maybe this person was a King of Pentacles in their verse, and they wanted you to, like, focus on that, but you already knew what was going on. You knew that this person acted this way because of these people. It wasn't necessarily all his fault, so you still had feelings for this person, or you still show love to this person, even though they're a very unreliable person, and they didn't provide, and they didn't protect, and they wanted you to, like, put this person out in the cold with them because they don't want to be out in the cold alone that's what i'm getting here it's like there's people out here that want you to like leave your person so that they could all be single together like it's like that type of energy like this person will this person on the outside will always be single and they don't want to be out here single alone or they don't want to be out here like you know what i mean it's like that type of energy it's like this could be like a fake friend too but it's not that you're in the two of wands energy. You just have better things going on with your life. Like you didn't hate hate this person or care for them. It was more like you were just focused on your life. They wanted it to consume you. They wanted you to get sick off of this. But you're in this energy. Look, nine of pentacles, six of like you. You could pick more. <laughs> There's more, plenty of fish in the sea. Every you have all the eyes on you. Knight of swords in reverse. They can't even take that. They can't. They can't fathom it. They can't understand it. That's why this person is like mad or these people are spreading rumors about you. Look, because you're too patient. And I'm, I'm getting like you're saying with due time, everything will come out. So you're not even trying to really dig for the secrets. You're just more like what you're still watching your back, but you're not going to be digging around for secrets. No, you're too busy in the temperance energy and you're too busy relaxing and manifesting in your life. Three of Wands wanted to come out. You're manifesting something. Because you know if this, whatever this masculine, you're not going to chase it. You're not going to make someone be reliable to you. It's not their issue. You're going to be reliable by yourself. I'm also getting like this masculine, like wanted you to stay connected to him in like a toxic way too. But you're like too much of an earth angel for that. It's like it's not even going to work. Like this person get her, get her, get down or lay down if they want to be around you. Is what I'm getting here. Like you can't control... You can't control this female. Whoever this female is, like, she just knows too much. She knows too much. She's too smart. Or she's tapped into the Akashic Records. A lot of you guys get a lot of your facts from your dreams. Like me, I do a lot of fighting. I, I fight a lot of my demons in my sleep. Like, I, I really, like, for people that know what sleep paralysis is, like, you, you know what I'm talking about. Like, I get approached the most by my enemies in my sleep. So, like... It's, I know what everybody's doing before they do it, but we're not going to get too deep into that. It's like, it's like that type of energy. This is your, this is your type of energy. I feel like I'm tapping into someone that, that does this. Clarify the temperance, please, with an, with the seven of cups in the reverse. The seven of cups is in the reverse is the outcome. No more secrets, no more illusions, no more lies. Two of, two of pentacles in the reverse. Look, someone here is like, they're going to be they really try to hold this up. They really try to keep this secret going. But it has to be dropped. Someone here is mad about that. They're ha they gotta drop people with mental issues. They gotta drop the fact that they have mental issues here and just give in to change because there's no more movies to play off of anymore. Either that, I feel like this person is very dramatic. I feel like this person thinks, I feel like this person is gonna start treating himself like a crash dummy. And that's only nicely said. This person might actually like, this person, they're like really dramatic. They feel like if they don't get their way, they're just going to end themselves. And that's, that's, that's pretty sick. Because there's people out there that have a worse life than you and you want to end yourself because, <laughs> you know what I mean? We have judgment here with self-esteem. Yeah, this person has low self-esteem. Whoever this whoever this person is or whoever these people are, like they need to get it together. But I understand that everyone has their own unique path and challenges. 
I possess the gifts of the soul that benefit me and others. It's like you're not even judging these people, to be honest with you. That's, this is why you win. You never really judged them. You just wanted to, like, I don't know. I feel like you wanted to teach them something or you wanted them to, like, respect you in a way, I guess. You wanted to show them something. I feel like they see it now. All, everything has been revealed. Um, this eclipse is bringing in a lot of, like, truth. We have empathy. I'm open to seeing both sides to a situation. That's your guys' energy. This is why you win. Abundance is in the reverse. Someone here is losing everything. They don't understand that because they're too worried about everything. They know that you're not worried about your abundance. You don't have to worry about your abundance. Because you live your life right. Yeah, we have regret here. I know that I cannot change the past. So this person who wants to start all over, they wish they could start their life over. I mean, once you start your life over, you, I guess you get another chance. I guess I believe in reincarnation. But you'd have to learn the same lessons. So you might as well just get your lessons out in this life. And I don't know. I won't get too deep into that and what I believe. We have grief here. I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. Just learn how to be more appreciative in life. Maybe you won't lose it. They lost someone with great empathy and now they're in grief. Because empathy is not really easy to find. This world is covered with narcissists. And now they're realizing that they, they cannot change what they've done here. There's someone here, there's an energy here learning this, and there's an energy here not learning this. And then there's an energy that knows everything. So even if you're not a tarot reader, you just know stuff, right? Someone here is wearing a mask. This person is wearing a mask. Like, this per this, is, this is a fake friend. I'm, I'm getting, like, fake friend energy here. So just watch the people around you. It's like... I feel like you know who's who though, even though this person wants to wear a mask. Someone is also pretending like they have to wear a mask around you because you're such a empathic person. Someone here likes to smile in your face. We have divine animals here. You're you're protected by like um, spiritual animals. Court issues is here, group stalking, obsession and codependency. I'm also getting like these people or this person is obsessed with you, but they need to be focused on their court issues. And they have like other people obsessed with you too. It's like sick. We have the sacral chakra energy. We have the sexual reproductive and pheromone. And then we have Reiki healing. Okay, so spirit is saying something about your sacral chakra. So maybe it needs to be balanced um, with your time alone. Yeah, you're a Reiki healer. You guys have like, it's like you can heal people. I don't know. It's like some people could do it with just their hands. And you guys can also be in the energy of like uh, meditating with like nature sounds. We have cold shoulder, cold hearted out here. Wish is fulfilled and heart chakra. Someone here is no longer being cold hearted. Their heart is being open to a situation. I feel like you've always wished this. Your wishes are being fulfilled. I, I, I'm hearing wish granted. With this specific person, I guess you get it, right? Not everybody you can change, but I'm, I'm guessing this person is like in the energy of like their heart chakra is open because I because you've always known that, that it wasn't this person with the issues it was the people around them new happier day you see let me do some more and then I'm gonna go ahead and do another channeled reading <clears throat> trying to be quiet because I gotta wake my kids up in a minute for school all right, let's see what's going on with my collective. Any more energies? But yeah, you're getting new, happier days. Like, no more coldness from a person. So you don't have to worry about anything. I feel like so something is very important about your sacral chakra, though, because I seen it when I was shuffling, too. So that's for somebody. Yeah, and then we have the, you know, the fifth chakra, throat, throat chakra energy. Speaking of, we have a pick me energy out here. I haven't seen that card in a while. Some here wants, just wants to be picked. Someone here wants to close your throat up so you can't speak and they want everybody to pick them. That's what I'm getting here with this energy. Like, they also, like, 
your children are very important too. Like your children are like, they have powers. We have isolation here. Someone said I pay for black magic. Someone here pay for black magic to keep you isolated. Okay. <laughs> but they're forgetting that they're giving you like, here's the thing about doing black magic on people that are isolated. Um, sometimes you're isolating someone that likes to be alone. So it's not really magic to them. Meanwhile, if you were in isolation, you'd be in a mental imprisonment. But now you're isolated because you wanted to do the black magic. That's why you watch what you do for other people. Not everybody got the same weaknesses as you. Some people actually like being alone. We have the next full moon out here. Um, I can't take what I dish out. See, like I said, this person can't even take the magic that they sent out to you. Wow. We have BDBM drama, so this could be like a, someone's ex, someone's child's mother or child's father who's learning a big lesson right now. So this could be like your child's father for some of you that's learning a, a lesson. Capricorn, the devil, boss, addiction, and control. I sent bad energy to your finances. Wow. A Capricorn sent bad energy to your finances. It's okay because this is spiritual war now. This has no longer anything to do with you guys anymore. Because now what they're doing, they're playing around with angels. They're, they're sending demo, demons to the angels that are protecting you guys. And they're going to leak some information out about these people. What do you give someone that has everything? Someone says you secretly inspire me. And then we have psychic tarot readings, caterpillar to butterfly. Someone here is actually like witnessing your growth. Um, someone could also be like trying to catch up on you through readings and they're realizing your growth too. And they want you to know that you secretly inspire them. Um, what do you give someone that has everything? Um, so I'm guessing that like this person just, I don't know, they know how to, they can, they can't really give you much, I'm guessing, because I feel like you don't want much from this person. Because what do you give someone that has everything? It's like, sometimes it's not what you give them, it's what you know. Um, if you're dealing with a high priestess, she just wants to know what you know. Like, say something smart. Like, can you do that? Like, I don't care for the things that... If you want to buy someone something, that's okay. But I feel like you're dealing with someone here that can buy everything themselves. So it's like now people just like to be with smart people, okay? <laughs> All right, so I'm going to do this next reading. Um, I hope this resonated for you and helped you guys out. Um, go ahead and like, subscribe, share to my channel so you don't miss any of my videos. See you next time. Bye.